Hi everyone, it's Laura Liz. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. So today I am going to be organizing my lipstick collection. Some of you may know that I have been collecting lipsticks for years now and basically I decided it's time, I need to get organized, it's a new year. I'm going to be organizing my lipsticks into three different categories. The first will be lipsticks that I am still using. So that will be any lipsticks that I wear in my day to day, any lipsticks that I use even occasionally that are still in good shape and not expired yet. My second grouping is going to be the throwaway group. So those are all lipsticks that are either expired and nasty or are way too old that are no longer usable. The third group is going to be the memory lipsticks. So because I am so attached to my lipstick collection, I really struggle with throwing them away. Basically any lipsticks that are either hard to get or a rare lipstick, you'll know what I mean when I show you, or a really unique color, even if it's not in great shape, those lipsticks I will keep as a memory. With that being said, let's get into it. I've been explaining this way too long, so let's get to it. So I have this tray of lipsticks, which should be my more frequently used set, along with this set, which is also a more frequently used set, or should be a more frequently used set. Then I have this chunk that are in my makeup bag. The ones in my makeup bag are obviously going to go in the keep pile. I use them frequently enough that they're in my makeup bag. I have a KVD Beauty. This is Lolita, but I think it's Lolita 2? This is one of the Lolitas, probably the more popular one. I have KVD's Exorcism. These two I use a lot, which you'd think that I wouldn't wear a dark red lipstick frequently, but the Jeffree Star Matte Liquid Lip in Leo. I also have Gemini, but that's in my purse, so I'm not gonna get it. And I have a third KVD that's um, a neutral tone, but that's in my purse. Um, the Jeffree Star Can't Relate. This was, I think, in a mystery box or something. I used to do like the surprise boxes that he did. So I still use this. So those are going in my frequently used. And then this, it's a matte red lipstick. I also have this bag filled with all the older lipsticks that I have. We're gonna see all of that after I get through these lipstick trays. Oh, also there's probably like four or five house labs lipsticks that I use pretty frequently as well that are not here. So this is like basically not an extensive lipstick haul. I also have the house labs lip in rose matte, which I have not tried yet, but I wear it frequently in another shade that's somewhere in this bag because I just like threw them all in the bag to show you all. Um, I have three baby lips, which are definitely too old to use. So baby Baby lips, if you remember, there were like commercials for them. They're from Maybelline. I think they recently started selling them again. But basically, baby lips were like the, they're like little chapsticks and they would come in different tints. I obviously got the bright pink one and then I have an orange one and another bright pink one, but with a different tube. Let me show you all close up. These were some of my first lipsticks too because they weren't like really lipsticks. So like in middle school, you could get away with that. So these are some of my oldest lipsticks when I first started like getting into lipstick. Oh my God, this is like used up. I don't think these are good anymore, but they are like a nice happy memory for me. So like I don't want to get rid of them. So maybe they'll go in like a memory pile. Next we have some really old ones. So I have like a red called, oh my God, Euphoria. This predates Euphoria though. This is a really old CoverGirl lipstick and it's just like a dark red. It got some good use, I can tell. And then I have another red that's Maroon Meow and it's Katie Cat Matte from Katy Perry's lipstick collection. I guess with CoverGirl, I guess their memory. I'll put them there for now. They're definitely expired and they're not usable. So for now, those will go with memory because I remember getting them and they were really special to me like early in my lipstick journey. Next, we have the NYX Liquid Suede. This is a bright purple lipstick and it has never been used before. So this is going with my current lipsticks, even though I have not worn it before. It's not even open, so I'm gonna just keep it. Next, we have the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick. This looks completely new. So it's going in that pile on the left. This one I tried, but I, I'm not that into glosses unless it's the Lady Gaga House Labs gloss, then that's a different story. But other than that, I'm not really into glosses. So this is the Infallible Lip Gloss 8 Hour. This is another L'Oreal. I'm gonna open it up. Yeah, this is like crusty. Okay, so I, I think we have our first throwaway. This is going in the throwaway pile. That hurts, but it's good, it's good. I should throw away lipsticks I don't use. Lipstick Mountain is falling on me. I want to take a break from the lipstick shelves. We have the Kylie Holiday Collection. This is from like 2018 maybe. I'll show you them because they're really, really cute. How do the beauty influencers do this? There we go. These are definitely not good anymore. So these are going in memory because these are still like really special for me. I got really into the Kylie Cosmetics lipsticks. I'm still into them. Kylie, if you want to sponsor me or if you want to like send me any PR, even though I'm not a beauty influencer, I would love that because I really love your brand. And I love your lipsticks so much. I love the Kylie Lip Kit. 
Candy K was my first of the shades. Um, but Kylie, most of my Kylie Cosmetics makeup is probably expired, so you should send me some more so that I can be up to date. I have the Kylie like Valentine's Day collection. This one was so cute, I loved it so much. So this is the Valentine's Day set. There we go, the Valentine's Day Kylie collection. I'm also keeping that as a memory. Oh, if you wanna know what shades were in them, you could probably look it up, but the holiday doesn't say what was in it. But the Valentine's Day collection has One Wish, Baby Girl, Angel, August Bug, all Nighter and Gorge. I loved Gorge, by the way. That was such a cute shade. This is the Kylie Birthday Edition. It's like completely ripped and one is missing. So I used one up entirely. This set got a lot of love. I loved this set. And then I have this new set. This I'm obviously keeping because this is brand new. This was the Kylie Kendall collab. And I got this at a pop-up truck that Kylie did to promote this, which was super cool. There's three shades and I can't wait to use this. And I also have this e.l.f. set that's a box. This has not even been opened. So lipsticks expire usually 12 months or 24 months after you got them. But my thing is, if you open the lipstick, I understand that that clock starts then. But if you don't open the lipstick, does that time period still apply? I haven't opened this yet, but this is at least four years old. So if I haven't opened it yet, when I open it, then does the 12 months start? Or did the 12 months already start and this just expired and I never got to use it? People on the internet, figure that out for me, please. It's going in the keep pile, but it would be really helpful if someone could tell me what that means because I have no idea. And I should because I collect so many lipsticks. This is a Bite lipstick or lip crayon. So um, this one's actually really cute. I've used it a little bit. I think it's probably still good. So it's going in the keep pile. We have the Lime Crime No She Didn't lipstick. This is the lipstick. I'm gonna keep this just in case I need it. We have KVD Beauty in Slayer. This is the studded kiss lipstick. And Slayer is a black lipstick. So I don't know if it's usable anymore because it's so old. I'm gonna keep it in the still using because I want to. And then I also have a dark green KVD Beauty. The shade is called Plan 9. This is the dark green and I barely used it because where am I gonna wear a dark green lipstick? So that is going in the keep and still using. Also, I see two that I still use here. They're House Laboratories. Of course, I have like all Lady Gaga's makeup, but these are the original House Labs like before she changed the packaging and changed her formula. Blaze and Attitude. I still use these. So these are going in the keep and currently using pile. This is Rhubarb. It it is a mini bite lipstick keep pile. Two more bite and they're both chai. So I'm gonna keep them. This is a small Sephora lipstick. <gasps> Oh my god, no! Well, this was a Sephora lipstick. As you saw, it's red. These are two Cliniques. We have Matte Plum. It's like this bright purple. And another Clinique in Think Bronze. So this shade I was obsessed with in high school. I think this goes in memory because this is empty. Last one in this set is a L'Oreal Fuchsia Orchestra. This is so expired, oh my god. So I'll get rid of this one. This next set we have five Jeffree Star Liquid Lipsticks. Two solid Jeffree Star lipsticks. Lipsticks, two lip glosses. This one is a special lipstick and it's a memory. This one is called Monster Red and it wasn't an official Lady Gaga lipstick, but it was going around in all the little monster chat rooms. If you know, you know, it's by Lipstick Queen. The special thing about this lipstick is that it is black and red. Let me show you guys up close. And then I have all these MAC lipsticks, so many. We have Viva Glam Gaga. This is a pink lipstick. Then we have Viva Glam Gaga 2, this nice neutral born this way shade. This red is a keep. This is Viva Glam Rihanna, real doll. Beautiful pink shade, keep. Gunner, dark purple shade, also keep. Silly, this is a bright pink that is unused, so keeping that. Epic, this is also not very frequently used. It's a dark purple, I'm keeping it. Power Driven, this is dark red and I'm keeping it, but I'll show you. Up the Amp, this is a bright purple and I'm obsessed with the shade and they don't sell it anymore, so I'm keeping this. I love it so much. Gray Friday, this is a very special shade. It was a Black Friday release and it is a dark gray lipstick. And the first time I wore this, a teacher came up to me and was like, Laura, are you okay? Because you're wearing basically a grayish black lipstick and I was like yes I'm fine because um, I had no idea that apparently wearing a dark lipstick in like 
I had no idea that wearing a dark lipstick indicated that something was wrong because for me it was just my artistic expression. And then I have these two glosses that are MAC glosses. One is Aviva Glam Lip Gloss. This is Nikki Tooth's the Nicki Minaj. And this is a dark purple gloss called Warp Speed Ahead. This was part of their Star Trek collection. So keeping that. The keep might get mixed up with the memory. I don't know exactly what I'm doing yet, but I just want to get these sorted. Next we have Ice Cream Boulevard and Jeffrey's Girl. So this is Ice Cream Boulevard. It is a light pink. Keeping that. Even though I never wear pink lipsticks, I just, I have to keep them all. They're in too good shape. They look like they still would work. Flamethrower. This one's separated, but um, I'm going to open it up and see if it's really bad shape because if it's not, I'm gonna keep it. Unfortunately, this one is hardened. It's going in the garbage pile. Ugh. I'm Realty is a purple one, another bright purple. It's still a little liquidy, but it's mostly hardened and I don't think that's safe to use. Clout, this is a light purple. Let me see if this still works. Yeah, this one's still good. And this is a super bright pink called Watermelon Soda. This one, I feel like is not that old, so let me see. Yeah, this one's good. Now I have this huge bag of lipsticks. So for this segment, I think I'm going to off camera count how many I have of everything and just tell you that because you probably don't want to sit through me sorting all of this. I might have a lipstick collecting problem. Also, shout out Japan LA. I love you guys. Um, and this tote is super cute. Here's the total count of lipsticks. I didn't count them yet, but I'll put it on the screen. This is insane. Okay, I have found four. Clinique lipsticks. These are all really old. Another Think Bronze, Raspberry Rush, Matte Magenta, and Raspberry Glossé. These are all kind of neutral shades, so I'm not gonna bother to show them to you guys. You can look them up if you need to. I'm gonna keep them as memory, maybe. I have a House Labs, still using this. This is actually one of my frequently used. I don't know how it ended up in this set. I found two in boxes. This is the Gloss Bomb Cream Fenty Beauty. Have not tried it yet, excited to. Rouge Artist Sassy Rhubarb. This is Makeup Forever. Haven't used this either, so that is going in the still using. Oh, this is a Fenty Beauty. <gasps> a dark blue lip crayon. I'm obsessed, I'm keeping that. And I found a Sephora gloss that I got. So these are gonna go together. Maybe you'll see me with like a dark blue lip one day. This I know is from middle school, so this is definitely garbage. But this is a Flipstick Blendable Lip Duo by CoverGirl. This is really old, but I remember loving it. And it looks like it's mostly used up. This is a Too Faced Melted Matte in dark blue. Love a dark blue lip, I'm keeping it. Clinique with two different sides. This is very old. I'm gonna put it in memory because I don't wanna throw Throw it out. <laughs> I'm gonna put it in the memory pile. This one that just fell over is a new one. This is a Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink Liquid Lip, and this is an Amazonian. I'm gonna keep this. This is the Urban Decay Revolution Lip Gloss, but this one I know is old. This is in Liar. It's going in memory because I I think it's pretty. This is basically me just showing you all my lipsticks and keeping them forever. And these, all the rest, are my Kylie collection. And this is the last of all of the lipsticks. Okay, so while I was organizing the Kylie's, I actually found another House Labs lip pencil. So of the Kylie's, they have all expired. I used these years and years ago. This is just a gloss. This is so cute. Kai Majesty King K. So we have Posy K. Exposed. This orange shade. This dark grayish one. It's shady. Head over here. Heels, Dirty Peach, Smile, 20, Dazzle, Rosy. This is the first of the Candy K's. I went through so many Candy K's. It was one of the original three. This is a mini Candy K from, I believe, the birthday edition. So that's where that missing one was. Another Candy K liner. This is Coco K, Love Bite. And then I have just the liner for Malibu. So I used up all of Malibu. They're going with my memories because I can't throw anything away. So I'll be keeping my whole Kylie collection. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like what you saw, be sure to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you can get a notification every time I post a new video. You can also follow me on my socials. I'm at LauraLizVids on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Spread positivity. Bye, guys.